I'm Blair Gilbert, aka Mr. Hardware, here for MrHardware.com and Gilbert's Pro Hardware. Uh, today I'm going to talk about screws and fasteners. Take a little of the mystery out of it. Now quite often, well people will take a screw and they will call it by the bottom of the screw. Quite often this screw is mistakenly referred to as a flathead screw. That's not true. This screw gets called by what you see after it's installed. So here after the screw is installed, you're going to see a pan head. So, hence, this is a pan head screw. It's oftentimes mistaken with its originator, the round head screw. The screw, when it's installed, you're going to see just something round. So these are both commonly referred to as round head screws. While well, we're looking at them, and then here, of course, is the flat head screw. It's installed, it will be flat. So while we're looking at these screws, we can notice that the different kinds of screwdrivers these screws will take. This screw is Phillips. This screw is a flat head or slotted screw. This screw is a combo headed screw. It's got a slot and it will take a Phillips. So it is a combo. These screws are good for going into when they're fully threaded. These screws are good for going in the sheet metal and wood. The threads are deep. There's a lot of threads, they're real strong. Here's another sheet metal screw. Thread it all the way up so when you attach it, it can draw right up to the bitter end. A wood screw has threads just in the lower half, lower two thirds. And so this screw is, is strictly a wood screw. It will not do sheet metal at all. Wood screws also tend to be a little softer than sheet metal screws. Sheet metal screws are made out of a harder material so when it goes metal against metal, the sheet metal screw will win. When a wood screw goes up against metal, usually the threads will start to strip out or rip off. Now another screw that's commonly mistaken as a fastener is a drywall screw. Drywall screws are Phillips headed usually. They are threaded all the way and they're usually a very coarse thread, a fast screw. This screw is preferred by a lot of installers of cabinetry and shelving because this screw goes in, they're hardened, so they're a strong screw. They have aggressive thread. They're very steep and not and thick, so when you install them, they zip in fast and hold things real well. They're a thin shank, so sometimes they can be a little weak for different projects, but it's a very handy screw. A common mistake of this screw is being called a drywall screw. People will use it to screw or hang things on drywall. This screw is not a fastener. It is made to go through drywall into wood to help hold the drywall to the stud. So this screw just runs straight in the drywall, will only last days, if that, for holding anything. And the minute you pull on it, those threads will just rip the drywall and that screw and whatever you've attached with it will fall out. So a drywall screw is to attach drywall. If I wanted to use that screw to go into to fasten something to drywall, I would put an anchor in, a conical anchor into the wall first. Then the screw, now a drywall screw is a little undersized for this anchor, but when this screw goes into this anchor, this anchor will expand and hold in the drywall. So a drywall screw needs an anchor. Then we have hex head sheet metal screws. A hex head sheet metal screw is just that. It's got a hex head. Sometimes it will have a slot in it to allow you to use two tools, but you choose a hex head sheet metal screw so that you can put a socket on your drill or your driver and you can run them in quickly and easily without stripping out. Now the last of the hex head screws is called a drill and tap or a tech screw. This is a sheet, hex head sheet metal screw with a drill bit built into the end of it. So I could come into steel like I'm attaching paneling to a trailer I can take and run this screw through the wood. It will drill through the steel, and being sheet metal, it will draw my material up against the metal. So I can use this screw to attach something to metal without having to drill a pilot hole in the metal first. That's a quick rundown of screws and fasteners and some heads. Thank you.